Hello everyone, uh, recently I've been doing a lot of design work, I've done some stuff and the most recent thing I've done is a podcast. Now, my first podcast was actually YouTube, which was a video podcast, which technically is called a vodcast, which is silly. But recently I've been looking into hosting podcasts on YouTube because it's free, it's cheap and there's unlimited bandwidth use and a load of other specifications. So I have designed an audio only um, overlay. So instead of just having a picture like I've seen a few people do, I've created a little system. So in the middle you will have the podcast logo, which would be whatever I decide to actually make after editing this. and. In the top, we will have the title of the section, and like a funny subtitle or whatever else. And in the bottom, there is going to be a. I haven't named this yet. Um, I guess a time bar. So, as you can see in a YouTube video, you got this red and grey bar that goes across the bottom of the screen, and that. The red bar shows you where you're at, or what you've watched, and then the grey bar is what's been loaded, and then the slightly lighter grey or white is what hasn't been loaded, but what's left of the video. So I'm going to take advantage of that by creating a video. So one thing I don't like about podcasts is that it's hard to skip forward or back. If you listen to it on your phone or something, you go back and you obviously miss, but there's like sections that you might want to skip. So say you listen to a video game podcast and they start talking about esports and you don't like esports and it's a weekly section. It's hard to skip because you don't know if it's going to last half an hour or two minutes. So down in the bottom I've made this bar and it should be a good example right now. I'm not sure how I'm going to end up doing this, but it's the names of the sections and the size of the sections corresponds with the size or the time on the screen. So I've made a little um, spreadsheet which shows you where everything is and it gives you able to calculate. So all you have to do is put in the hour, minutes and seconds of the podcast which you'll be able to see after you've edited it. So after I've edited this I'll start working on this. And then there's the section. So you split up your sections, you know what you do. So there's like the intros, uh, what's new, I guess, uh, listener feedback, or questions, or competition, or stuff like that. And then that'll tell you how many questions it is. So as we're going through, I should be animating this so it pops up and down, and you can skip to which section you like. So I thought that was pretty nifty, Richard. That was on the top, inspired by IGN's mixed reviews. So I brought that down so it will correspond to a uh, actual timeline. And then, yeah, that's it. I think it's a simplistic, minimalistic, slightly clever design. Um, thanks for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, rate, comment, all that. Blah, 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 blah. Out.